Welcome to Cam Look, your daily dose of the Cincinnati Art Museum. Each weekday, a staff member or a volunteer will share an object from the permanent collection and pose questions for discussion. Check back every day at 10 a.m. for a new work and a new discussion. Hi, I'm Helen, a docent at the Art Museum. Today, I'd like to introduce you to our Japanese no masks in Gallery 139 of our Asian Wing. I like to use these masks for our popular school tour, World Cultures and Traditions. CAM has three no masks. Two are for the formal performances, and one is for Kyogen, short, comic plays used between acts to relieve the tension of the main drama. No masks are made of painted Japanese cypress wood. Our three exquisitely carved masterpieces each represent a different character. What is no? It's a classical Japanese drama characterized by very slow movements and accompanied by traditional Japanese chanting and music. In this diagram, you see the main actor in the center, the mu musicians behind him, and the chanters to the right. This unique art form developed in the late 14th century and also includes mime and dance. Like the tea ceremony and calligraphy, no drama is closely linked to Zen Buddhism. No masks are worn by the principal actors and are important to the drama. They are grouped into five categories, gods, men, women, ghosts, and demons. Here an exorcist tries to drive out a demon who haunts Lady Aoi in a play based on the tale of Genji. This cam mask portrays an old man and was used to represent the fishermen or woodcutters who appear in the first act of many no plays. However, in the second act, these men turn out to be gods or tormented souls. Our mask of a male ghost may have been used for a play in which the ghost of a man dances out the misery and pain he must suffer as punishment for his wicked life. This fine mask was carved by Zeken Yoshimitsu, the founder of a line of no mask makers in the 17th century. No costumes are bold and often colorful, as we see in this jacket for a female role, which includes gold leaf embroidered on purple silk. In earlier times, patrons of no gave exquisite costumes like this one to their favorite actors. Our Kyogen mask shows a charming female character. Her face is a bit homely, but the dimp dimples in the full cheeks make her cheerful and lovable. Kyogen masks typically portray nameless characters and ordinary people. This popular Kyogen play is about two servants who are tied up by their master so that they don't drink the sake while the master is away. But by working together, they manage to get quite drunk. Our no masks were donated to the museum by the artist Robert F. Blum, who was born in Cincinnati in 1857. He lived in Japan from 1890 to 1892 while he worked on a commission for Scribner's Magazine to illustrate a series of articles on Japan. While there, Blum developed a strong interest in Japanese arts and was fascinated by no theater. He even took lessons in order to make better drawings of this subject. Based on his travels in Japan, Blum painted our popular The Silk Merchant, now on view in Gallery 121 in our Cincinnati wing. Masks are used around the world by many different cultures. They can be physical, like a Halloween mask, or emotional, when you hide your true feelings behind a smile or a frown. How do you feel when you put on a mask? Is it a physical mask or an emotional mask? Do you do it for fun or to protect yourself? Thank you for visiting Cam Look today.